The Mortis Gods are three powerful entities representing aspects of the Force. In the Star Wars galaxy, they are better known as the Father, the Son, and the Daughter. This depiction of them also represents the familial themes within Star Wars. But they seem to be missing an important aspect, the Mother. Excluding the Mother could have been intentional, so that the writers could create a new lore around an anticipated character. But could this character be someone the fans already know? In Star Wars Legends, we have gotten clues or confirmations non-canonically of the existence of the mother. In Legends, she was a mortal servant who became so close to the family of immortal Force users that they began to call her the mother. In order to gain immortality and join the family proper, she seeks a dark path to the Force, which corrupts her and turns her into an immortal monstrosity known as Abeloth. Balin Skull's discovery at the end of Ahsoka Season 1 seems to hint at more stories focused around the Ones, which could mean a canon representation of Abeloth. Another character shrouded in mystery was Anakin Skywalker's mother, Shmi. This theory states that Shmi Skywalker was actually the mother in disguise. While the two are very different, they share some key similarities. Both women are abandoned by their families. Shmi willingly tells Anakin to go with Qui-Gon and leave her behind to a life of slavery, while Abeloth was imprisoned by her family and abandoned due to her unpredictable nature. A key difference between the two is that Abeloth never actually gave birth and was instead a surrogate mother to the son and the daughter. In the meantime, Shmi gave birth to Anakin without a father. Both were guiding figures to some of the most powerful Force users to ever exist. There are several ways that Shmi Skywalker could be revealed to have been the mother. Everything you have learned has led you here. For starters, the visitors of Mortis often have little memory of the place. Even Ahsoka, who carries the life force of the daughter, does not quite remember her time there. This could also explain the birth of Anakin. If she was pulled to Mortis and Anakin was conceived, she may not have a recollection of the event and instead believe that he just appeared. Revealing Shmi as the mother would explain a lot. Your fate. It would fill in the gaps of the Mortis gods missing a mother, and Anakin's unknown if not non-existent father. It would also explain why Anakin is the chosen one, or at the very least, why he is so powerful with the Force. Then you will die. What do you think? Is Shmi Skywalker secretly Abeloth?